dead after being hit by a truck right here in the basin. Fox 24's Marco Ramirez joins us live in Midland County. Marco, these types of accidents have been happening quite frequently. Monica, TxDOT tells me auto pedestrian accidents have been happening a lot more here in West Texas and tonight it's urging people both behind the wheel and crossing the streets to be more careful. It's tough. You don't want to see anybody getting hurt. That's the main thing. You want, to, you want the roads to be safe. Texas DPS is investigating a deadly pedestrian accident along FM 1788 in Midland County. DPS says 30-year-old Alexander Marshall was killed after a truck hit him while walking down the road. This is the third fatal pedestrian accident in the Midland Odessa area we've reported on this month. TxDOT says there are ways to prevent these types of accidents. As a pedestrian, um, you need to be really aware of your surroundings. Um, that means you can't be on your cell phone, you can't have headphones on. DPS says most pedestrian accidents happen in the early morning or nighttime. Local drivers like Corey Daniels say the West Texas roads are also to blame. And, uh, I know the road conditions, There's, I know a lot of things, a lot of the roads even look unsafe. There's, there's a lot of potholes and stuff that we're seeing, a lot of construction zones, and you know, so we just got to be safe. Slow down. But pedestrian accidents are also frequent across the state. TxDOT says more than 3,000 pedestrians have been killed within the last five years. And while this latest deadly accident happened along a county road, TxDOT hopes both drivers and pedestrians are safe, even in rural areas. Please protect yourself and, and stay away from the lanes of traffic because uh, if you can stay on the bar ditch or stay, in the, stay off the, the, the paved road, you'll, you'll be much safer. Now this accident is still under investigation by DPS. TxDOT is also urging drivers not to be distracted when driving at night and for pedestrians to wear bright colored clothing when walking in the dark. Reporting live in Midland, I'm Mark Ramirez, Fox 24 News.